France, once a titan of industry with a unique approach, faces a critical turning point. Its historical emphasis on artisanal production and worker rights, while commendable, now hinders its competitiveness in the globalized world. This essay navigates the challenges and choices France confronts. A glorious past and uncertain future. Industrial Revolution France embraced the revolution but opted for a slower, steadier approach, favoring small-scale industries over large factories. This fostered a more egalitarian society where workers held significant power. Modern Dilemma This unique past, while admirable, presents obstacles in today's fast-paced world. France struggles to adapt to changing economic demands without alienating its historically empowered workforce. Cut between tradition and progress. Unsustainable status quo. Maintaining the current economic model is untenable due to global pressures and national issues. Radical change unpalatable. Drastic reforms risk sparking social unrest, mirroring past events where skilled workers felt disenfranchised. A compromised solution and uncertain outcome. Present reality, France's current approach seems like a suboptimal compromise, neither fully embracing change nor maintaining its traditional strengths. Symbolism of change, the rise of a luxury goods magnate as France's richest person exemplifies the shift away from its industrial roots. Questions at the crossroads. Necessity of change, why does France need to radically reshape its economy? Challenges to change, what impedes effective reform? Stagnation's peril, what awaits France if it continues on its current path? Investing in the future. Public services, France's investments in education and public services aim to boost the economy and sustain future spending. Disclaimer, this text focuses on the economic analysis, omitting the promotional content about trading 212 and the industrial revolution section. I hope this revised version retains the original meaning while being concise and focused. A unique path, France's industrial revolution differed from its European peers, favoring small-scale industries over large corporations. This fostered worker empowerment but hampered competitiveness in the modern world. Legacy of choice, while France developed slower, it built a more egalitarian culture with strong worker protections. However, this came at the cost of slightly lower productivity and wages. The balancing act, France's economy navigates a complex dance between its historical emphasis on worker rights and the need for global competitiveness. This has led to Strong government intervention to address weaknesses in certain sectors, France established state-owned enterprises like Air France and High Speed Rail, aiming for a balance between market forces and state guidance. Challenges and trade-offs, while this approach offers advantages like large-scale infrastructure, it can also create inefficiencies and limit private sector innovation. The burning questions. Can France maintain its unique economic model in a globalized world? How can it balance worker protections with necessary reforms for competitiveness? What are the potential consequences of stagnation or drastic change? Investing in the future, France's investments in public services like education aim to empower its workforce and adapt to future demands. Disclaimer, this revised text focuses on the core economic analysis, omitting the promotional content and the industrial revolution section. I hope this version remains concise and retains the original meaning while focusing on the key themes. France's unique economic path with strong worker protections and state intervention faces challenges in the globalized world. This analysis explores the historical roots, current dilemmas, and potential futures. A divergent path, France's industrial revolution favored small-scale industries, leading to strong worker rights but slower productivity compared to large-scale competitors. This created a trade-off between social well-being and economic efficiency. Balancing Act To address weaknesses in key sectors, France established state-owned enterprises, SOEs, like airlines and railways. While providing essential services, these SOEs can struggle with efficiency and innovation compared to private competitors. The efficiency trap, France's high employment levels, driven by SOEs and generous benefits, can create inflationary pressures. Wages rise faster than output, leading to a wage price spiral and eroding competitiveness. Aging population, with a growing elderly population expecting strong retirement support, the burden on young workers increases. Balancing this with competitiveness requires delicate solutions. Competing strategies, France is currently trying a mix of boosting productivity and reforming unsustainable systems. However, this risks alienating both those who benefit from current protections and those who demand change. Lux advantage, France's image of artisanal quality remains a valuable asset, allowing luxury goods to command premium prices. 
However, this cannot sustain the entire economy. Living beyond means France has offered its workforce a high quality of life, but this has come at the cost of competitiveness. Catching up requires difficult and unpopular reforms. Uncertain future, while France is adapting to the global economy, the consequences of past choices remain. The country faces a complex path to regain its economic footing. French tenacity, despite the challenges, France's history of strong social movements ensures that any changes will be met with vocal reactions. Disclaimer, this revised text focuses on the core economic analysis, omitting the promotional content and non-essential sections. It aims to be concise and informative while retaining the key points of the original.